With some creativity, we can create some really unique effects with just a simple DSLR camera and household tools. That's why we've packed five lens hacks you can do right now. Hey folks, my name is Jordi for Cinecam.net. Every Tuesday and Friday we share creative tips and tricks for filmmakers. For today all you need is a DSLR camera that is able to interchange lenses. For the rest we'll just use household stuff like this transparent tape. You want to stick it vertically on your lens, but be careful that you're not making any fingerprints as that will make your image vague. Same goes for having air bubbles, so apply it carefully. Now film right into a light source and you'll see a horizontal light leak, or in other words, an anamorphic lens flare. Put some crop marks on your footage and some cinematic color grading and bang you've got yourself a Hollywood look with just a sticker on your lens. Some might have already heard about this trick but then with a fishing wire, but we seem to get better results with a wider tape. For the second trick, you want to take a black piece of paper. Get out any shape in the middle you'd like. I'm cutting out a heart. Next cover your lens with this paper and make sure that the cutout shape sits in the middle. You'd be surprised now of how little surface of your lens is actually being used. Film again in the direction of a light. It works better if you have multiple sources of smaller lights. Now when you pull your focus back you'll get a nice bokeh with your custom shape. This works best on longer lenses and sometimes you need to crop your image in post as well as you see heavy vignetting. Trick number 3. Grab some nylon stockings and clamp them between your lens and camera body. If you have a speed booster or adapter, make sure to clamp that behind it. You want to be as close as possible to the sensor. Be careful though doing this, it's important that the fabric is clean from dust. Now you'll able to get a nice soft look that you typically see in soap series like the Bold and Beautiful. Skin textures get softer and light sources will give a bloom effect. We've got two more tricks coming right after our sponsor's message. When giving a presentation, delivering your content in a clear way is necessary for your audience to understand everything. However, it's also good to add dynamic visuals to keep your audience focused. A perfect way to do this is by using infographics. On video blocks, you can choose out different After Effects templates to suit your needs. Add just the text, the icons and blow your audience away with your awesome presentation. Visit videoblocks.com for more templates and stock footage. Just follow the link in the description below. Trick number 4. We can transform any lens into an extreme macro lens with this very simple hack. By detaching your lens and keeping a small gap between your body, you can go super close to any object. Of course with a detached lens you'll get enormous light leaks, so we'll cover that gap up with a homemade tube. I used some hard carton, but anything will do. Important is that it seals the light from the outside and that you have a good grip to keep your lens still. You can also buy such tubes that have an actual Nikon or Canon mount for a very low price. You can purchase one from our website, there's a link in the description below. And finally the last lens hack for this video. When filming outside during the day, you can easily get the sky overexposed. And when you close the aperture, the subject gets underexposed. So here's a solution. Take your sunshades and cover only the top part of your lens. This acts like a neutral density filter now, but only for the very bright sky. You could see some ghosting happening now, so it's not for every situation. But if you have a plain blue sky, nobody will know that you're cheating. For more tips and tricks make sure to hit that subscribe button here above my hat. There's also a little bell icon next to it to enable notifications so that you'll be the first to see when we publish a new tutorial. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget, stay creative. <laughs>